Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I have a night routine. This is so highly requested, so let's just get right into it. The first thing I do is I get home from school and I set my phone and backpack down on my kitchen table and then I head into the fridge and get some food. I'm always so hungry after school. And lately I've been trying to eat a little bit healthier, um, so I'm just taking out like, I forget what this is called. It's some healthy bread though. I think it's like Dave's something bread you can see it on the cover right there but I'm just toasting that and I believe it's 60 calories per piece I don't really check calories that much but I think that's better it's a good snack I take that out of the toaster and then just put some turkey on it for some protein by the way if you're wondering why I changed it's because when I put my bread in the toaster I just changed into some different clothing because I was uncomfortable in that dress all day so I take that out of the toaster, put the turkey on it, and then I go and sit down and eat my snack and just kind of look through social media, Instagram, Twitter, read my emails, look at YouTube comments on like my YouTube app, and then I get up, get a water, and I start my homework. Ever since I was little, my mom kind of taught me just to get your homework done when I got home straight away from school. It makes it so much easier. So if you procrastinate, try getting home, eating a snack, having your little time for your phone, and then just sit down, buckle down, do your homework. It's a lifesaver. For those of you asking, I'm in school, you know, just as much as probably you are. I'm a regular high school student, seven hours a day. I don't do online or anything like that, so I feel your pain. <laughs> I take out my notebook, and then what I like to do is just write my agenda. So I just kind of write down what I have to do for the night homework-wise and studying-wise. So I just write that down, and then after I'm done with my homework, I head upstairs and I am starting to work out a little bit more. So I go up into my room and I get some socks and my workout shoes. And luckily I'm already in workout pants. These are from Lululemon. So yeah, I just changed shirts. I'm in my workout gear. And then I'm heading to my gym to go work out. So I head into my gym and I did the stair climber but okay so I was gonna do the treadmill but I couldn't figure out how to turn it on my sister figured it out there was like a side button I had to press so then I just went to the stair climber because my gym in my house just was finished so I haven't used it yet I've been mostly doing soul cycle but anyway you can see I'm struggling with this a little bit but yeah this is a stair climber and I am just climbing fake stairs and it hurts your butt and legs so badly. So after that, I go ahead and shower. I didn't wash my hair, but I just wanted to show you guys what I used since I washed it last night. And I just got my hair cut and they told me I shouldn't wash it every day. So those are all the products I use. They will be linked below. And then I'm showing you a little skincare preview. I'm going to do a whole video on this because I do some other things besides just this. But I use my Pond's Cold Cream Cleanser and I remove my makeup with this this is my favorite makeup remover i am so over those neutrogena wipes because i feel like i'm tugging at my skin so i love this it's just a cream it's super soft and it just removes makeup so amazingly and also that purity simple cleanser that was just in my shower that tan bottle no it was clear bottle with like that tan product i use that in the shower to wash my face and take off the makeup and then i go in after my shower and i use the pond's cold cream and then this garnier micellar cleansing water on a cotton pad and i don't what i wipe my um pond's cold cream off with this wipe here because it's so much more gentle on my skin i'm not tugging i know it's going to prevent wrinkles in the future and then i go in with another face cleanser i'm very diligent with my skincare because i don't like acne <laughs> so i just you know massage that into my face and then i wash my face and this next step is kind of essential to my skincare and that's toner wait let me let the video catch up okay so this is my maddie skincare toner i just put this on a cotton pad and rub this all over my face i said this in my morning routine recently which will be linked down below if you guys haven't seen it but i don't really know what toner does because i'm not a skincare specialist but it works for me and then I use my hydro care lotion this is for irritated skin so I really love it it's super gentle and that's my skincare and then I go and put on some comfy clothing I'm just see I wanted the black ones but then I switched to these big comfy gray sweats from H&M and just a regular top and then I head down to the kitchen and eat some dinner I my mom picked up salads from this um, restaurant called La Scala in LA and it's good I I mean, it's just a salad. I wasn't too hungry since I also had that after-school snack, which was pretty filling. Um, so the little salad was really tasty, but usually we have dinner as a whole family. 
since I was just filming and my timing was off, my sister was in a tutor, my mom was with her friend inside the house. Um, so, yeah, we usually have dinner as a big family. My mom usually cooks and stuff, but tonight it's a little bit different. So, I just kind of showed you what I was doing tonight. But it's usually with my dad, my mom, my sister, and sometimes my brother if he's home. And then I come back upstairs and I brush my teeth. And by this time, I know it looks bright, but it's usually pretty late by this time. And I'm pretty much done with all my work and everything. So that's really great. That's why I love doing my homework right when I get home. I crawl right into bed. I watch some YouTube videos. And that's it. So thank you so much for watching. I really hope you guys all enjoyed it. And I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.